It's a heavyweight showdown between the Black Beast, Derek Lewis, and Alexi Olenek. Well, this is one intimidating fighter making the walk here tonight. No denying what the game plan is going to be, Joe. He's going to try to shoot in on the legs, get his opponent down, and employ some of the more nasty ground and pound that we have seen in the UFC really in years. Very strong at maintaining the top position. Devastating out of the side mount as well. But top position, nasty punches, elbows from inside the guard. This guy, as good a ground and pound guy as we've seen in years, figures to be a big challenge for the opposition tonight. This guy has devastating power to his kicking technique. Whether it's to the legs, the body, or the head, if one of those lands, you've got real problems. So here's the Black Beast, Derek Lewis. He gets the better of the striking in most of his UFC encounters. Takedown defense is on point. He's an underrated grappler as well, Joe. Born in New Orleans, Louisiana, but the Black Beast claims Houston, Texas. Houston certainly claims the Black Beast. They believe they've got an eventual UFC champion on their hands. This guy has taken shots to the jaw that would put many fighters unconscious and pressed forward as if nothing happened. His chin is legendary. And now our tail of the tape for this heavyweight fight. So a more than five year gap between these two fighters when it comes to the age, and they both possess a similar height and reach. Here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon is Herb Dean. This is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold-out Bell Center in Montreal, Quebec, Canada! <laughs> This man is a wrestler, only a professional record of 57 wins, 11 losses, and one draw. He stands 62 inches tall, weighing in at 240 pounds. Fighting out of Moscow, Russia, Alexei, the boa constrictor of the And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the right corner. This man is a boxer, only a professional record of 21 wins, six losses, and one no contest. He stands six feet three inches tall, weighing in at 260 pounds, fighting out of Houston, Texas, Derek the Black Beast Lewis. You've been given your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves. Let's make it official. This has been one of the most highly anticipated matchups for a long time. And ladies and gentlemen, strap yourselves in because it's about to go ready. down right ready. now. And we are ready for live action here at the Bell Center in Montreal, Quebec. Guys have proved to be dangerous in the opening seconds of this fight. Huge uppercut misses. Splits the guard, connects with the punch there, Joe. Oh! oh! He tagged him! He's got him hurt here. Body kick, look at that. Powerful oh, uppercut. uppercut. Wow. He blocks the shot. Nice punch there by the Black Beast. Well-placed kick there by Olenek. Well, he absorbs a kick to the head here, left it wide open. He's got to not move into that power shot. Let's see if he can adjust. He's 
side control here. Excellent movement here on the ground. Oh, he got reversed. Back to his feet. And the takedown attempt. But he does not land it. Lewis gets absolutely pelted by that head kick. Straight right hand now just misses. High level MMA defense there, able to avoid the punch. Nice job by Olenek. Caught the kick. Well, they made all the right reads here tonight, and there's another one. Beautiful read on the leg strike as he catches it and then returns fire with a punch of his own. So they have got the timing down here oh. at this point of the fight. Man, this could be it right here. Back to his feet again. Amazing. Oh, what a leg kick. Oh, very nice. 90 seconds now to go in the round. submission and got the victory. Right, I mean, how do you not admire the focus of this young fighter? You could tell he was looking for that submission much earlier in the round, but he didn't want to rush it. He stayed patient, let the setup do its thing, and ultimately the submission materializes organically late in the round. High-level stuff out of that young fighter here tonight. And here we see it again. Beautiful submission victory. So a seminal moment for him here tonight, Joe Rogan, as he gets the win by way of submission. Certainly one of the bigger wins of his career and as big a statement as he could have made here tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean is going to stop for this contest at 4 minutes, 47 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by tap out due to a twister, Alexi, the power constrictor. Well, at this point, all that is left is the celebration, and it's nice to see this fighter sharing a moment with his coaches and training partners after the big submission win here tonight. He had no shortage of naysayers coming in. A lot of people said he couldn't come in here and submit a foe of this quality. Well, that should mute the masses a little bit. That should set him up for a big fight moving forward. Tonight, though, as I mentioned, all about the celebration, and it is on in the corner.